A brilliant counter-attacking eight-wicket stand between Johnny Bairstow and Mark Wood helped England end the first day of the second test on 294-8 against New Zealand in Christchurch. The duo added 95 runs to revive England's innings after they were reduced to 164 runs for seven at one stage. Bairstow scored unbeaten 97 while Wood got out after scoring 52 runs. Team Saudi and Trent Bolt had again tormented England's top order batsmen. They continued to exploit England's inability to handle the swinging ball. The duo had taken one wicket each in the first session but blew away the rest of the England's top order shortly after lunch by removing Joe Root, David Mullan, and Mark Stoneman within the space of nine balls, sparing only one run. At the end of the day, Saudi took five wickets while Bolt pocketed the rest of the three wickets. England had been in danger of being bowled out for under 200 when Stuart Broad was caught at the mid off to leave them floundering at 164 for seven shortly after tea. However, Bairstow and Wood took advantage of a softening aging ball to save England from more embarrassment following the 58 they scored in the first innings of the opening test, which was their record low against New Zealand.